This is a nice little French antique clock, made about 1900 in Paris. It's tortoiseshell veneer and with ormolu gilt mounts. The dial is enamel. It has Arabic numerals, pierced skull hands, and painted flower garland decoration to the centre. Two winding holes, one for the time, one for the strike, and a broco adjuster above 12, which is for adjusting the clocks fast or slow. These clocks run for eight days. The striking is on a gong, and the half hour it strikes once, and at the hour it strikes one for each hour. In this case, it will be ten. The clock movement is by Samuel Marte, Paris. Eight day movement with a long pendulum. You can see the gong that the clock strikes on here and the hammer that it strikes with. The maker's mark is just behind the pendulum there. You can see it as the pendulum passes it by. Very reliable movements. They will really go on forever if properly looked after. We have serviced it and it's running perfectly. With these clocks, condition is all important. The tortoiseshell veneer really has to be perfect, with no chips or cracks or blisters. This clock has a side viewing window that lets you see the pendulum and whatnot from the side. Four finials to the top and the carrying handle. The metal mounts are brass, gilt brass or ormolu. All in all, this is a very nice clock. They're hard to find now, especially in this condition. We did not clean the ormolu mounts. This is the way the clock should look after a hundred odd years of use. And that's the way it is now. The clock is for sale on my website, which is ianburton.com. You'll find contact details there and other details about the clock, dimensions, etc.